Hey guys, so one fine morning, team bloggers on the road set out on the road to travel to Amritsar and let's take a look at our trip. So as we set out in our stylish new Ford EcoSport, we made our first pit stop at Ahuja at Murthil where we stopped for tea and paratha. This is undoubtedly one of the best places on the highway to have your morning tea and some light breakfast. After that crispy paratha topped with some white makhan, we set out on the road again after a little bit of shopping and this time we wanted to go to another dhaba, stopped at Jilmil Dhaba which is also a famous dhaba on Muthal. But surprisingly here we were left asking for more. You see the uh, butters are left in the plate which is, it means I didn't like the butter. Parathas are good, so I'll rate them at 2.5. I like Aujas better than uh, Then after we straight away stopped at Jalandar Haveli and after a traditional welcome we sat down to have our dal makhani, alu varia and crispy naan. So we are at Haveli Jalandar and we had just amazing flanky garlic naan with some uh, dal makhani and alu varia. Varia is very famous in Amritsar and uh, alu varia is a very unique dish to Amritsar. So instead of choosing shahi paneer or something I would suggest do order alu varia. I would raise this place 4.5 out of 5. The countryside view en route to Amritsar is always a pleasure to look at and here is our team enjoying the ride in the Ford Eco Sport. After a 10 hour long but comfortable journey, we finally reached Hyatt Amritsar. The hotel offers luxurious 5 star stays. If you are planning to travel to Amritsar, Hyatt Amritsar is the place to stay in. More on Hyatt Amritsar in another video to follow. After resting for some time, we head out for some local sightseeing. Now we are at the Jallianwala Park and let's take a walk inside. You can see this is a very narrow lane and when the massacre happened here, this was the only point from which entry and exit was possible and that is why a lot of people lost their lives here. So this is the well where a lot of people jumped to save themselves from the British Army and in the end around 120 dead bodies were also recovered from this well. There are several bullet marks. In total, 28 marks on the wall where the British Army fired. When in Amritsar, you cannot go back without a visit to the Holy Golden Temple. The temple also prepares and serves food to thousands of visitors on an everyday basis. The Langars at the Golden Temple set the best of example in community service in the whole world. We wrapped up day one with some light bites and pita chicken. We hope you enjoyed this journey with us. Do subscribe to our channel and stay tuned to follow bloggers on the road.